So in my last video guys, you seen that I came to realization that I had been suppressing my creative energy for a while and so I just had to get back on track and focus on doing things what I truly love to do, which is making art. First getting back to drawing and painting filming it all as always making some cool thumbnails for my smr and r channel my mission this summer will be to make this van into a proper studio yeah maybe i would like maybe like a proper camper van uh, but um, it is what each man and uh, i am very happy and grateful for what i already have okay but where do we start so i think that the biggest thing is um, the hanging clothes so basically i need them to be hanged up not folded in boxes and all the designs say uh, take some ideas from the other travelers they they mostly have like a simple life uh, they have their clothes folded in boxes or suitcases or whatever and so it doesn't those designs don't work for me although they're nice they just don't work for me for me it needs to be either a big wardrobe and then where where i still need to carry the spare wheel uh which takes up the back which i then can't make into the wardrobe and the wardrobe would uh, block the back door as well if i had it there i first thought i would have it there and then clothes hanged up like this and then the door and then it would be nice actually the mirror large mirror which i am bloody missing in here i have a large mirror with me but then every time i just need to take it out which is all right it's still doable but it's not like that large i i just want a very large mirror i loved mirrors all my life so it would be great to have one just there or i was thinking to put something mirror like on the doors on the side doors then i would have mirror just there on the side doors guys can you let me know is there kind of like a film so you can just glue it on top of the doors that would be interesting that could be solution and then this one it's great because this one i can turn it into a sofa because kind of sitting space is always uh, useful whereas if i had the bed like this which i absolutely loved uh, then it would be this massive bed and then the storage under the bed and get into the storage would be me crawling uh, on my knees to get to things and find things which which doesn't really work i already tried that it's just much easier when you have things on display like shelves and then you can see you know what's in there you can open the drawer and you know what's in there and um yeah so and it's always nice to have a sofa for you but also for the guests where to sit so yeah i think i guess this is it this is the one i actually stripped down the first design what i did and then i changed and changed and then finally i have stripped down to what actually kind of works for me so what the hell i'm thinking i already have it I just need to make little adjustments, so... Meanwhile, meeting the other van lifers, checking out their vans for the inspiration. Well, perhaps not really looking at anything like this, but definitely at the vans like this, which are more down to earth and highlights the simple living. Where are you from? Scotland. Scotland, yay! The Highlands. Nice, nice oh wow i love her van it's so gorgeous it's so simple setup but it's so pretty it's pretty and cozy and I like the color she's got a wood burner in the van inside the van wow wow amazing and what what kind of wood you're using something you can find in, in nature spain, orange wood in spain and olive oh okay. at home 
birch, oak, ash, elm. All right. Whatever I can get that's dry. Yeah. And you tried this thing out, didn't you? I live with this on the, it's on the whole winter. It doesn't blow. Wow. Off. Even when I'm driving, there's smoke coming oh out. Oh my god. <laughs> the petrol station. This is and so cool. like, oh, Get out of my forecourt, you fool. Why? Wow, that's amazing, that's amazing. And the windows as well. My van doesn't have any windows. Was it like mine? No windows. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, yeah, there's another one. Much more modern than mine. Alfie! Hello, Alfie! And you're loving this lab, don't you? You love Spain. Is it not too hotty for you? Not too hotty? Been today, so oh, you've been swim swimming. That's he good. That looks yummy. What is it? Chicken korma. Oh. All homemade. Oh, so nice. Yeah. Looks gorgeous. Smells gorgeous. That's gorgeous. <laughs> yeah. I'm promising this yeah. one. We are, of course, in Vera Playa, in the naturist uh, area, and uh, one gentleman really kindly he just goes and picks up the litter. Thank you for doing that. It's a pleasure. Yeah. I enjoy doing it. Yo soy, de, yo soy de Mallorca, pero, ¿eh? Oh, qué bien. Mallorca. Un, un mallorquín viajero. Qué bien. Love. Yeah. Oh, love. The love is the way, you know. This is my Instagram. If you Subscribe, follow. Esto que os voy a regalar. En serio oh. os va a regalar. Qué sí, bonito, hombre. Y sí, muy buena energía. Ay, tan ¿verdad? bonito. He wants to give us back the good energy he felt. Claro, mira, te lo voy a poner a ti mientras que ella graba. This is my craft. I'm artisan. I make uh, avocado seeds. Oh, qué bonito! Mm -hmm. Wow, muchas gracias. Con la con la sabiduría del aguacate. Ah, llevas un ojo de tigre. Muchas gracias, Juan. Llevas un ojo de tigre que esto es. Uy, oh, el ojo de tigre lo necesitaba. Oh, Me está regalando un ojo oh. de tigre. Qué bonito. Strong. Wow. Mm. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you so much. <laughs> oh my God, it's so lovely. It's a good feeling. Oh, I just love this space. I just love it. I absolutely adore this. It just looks so soft and so warm and so amazing. That's why I use this material in the first place. And then I can add a little art on top of it. We've got some art started here. Uh, yeah, that's work in progress, but oh, I just love this space. And this side unit actually is my favorite. My absolutely favorite It's just gorgeous. And so actually I have uh, my bar chairs, my leather bar chairs in Latvia. I will just uh, bring one here. So then I can sit on it and just work here. Uh, it's just amazing space. My favorite space ever. That's why I'm trying to make something, put something nice up there uh, to inspire me. It's just work in progress. So it's just bags. Yeah, I, I got something like this for the art projects and uh, these also I found, these need to be painted, I want to paint these spoons, make them, like, customize them. Then, uh, yeah, so this, this is funny, guys. So, see the paints, and, and what did I do when I left Latvia? I got everything with me, even the music equipment, um, to make music. Have I written a song this winter? Of course not. But the only thing I didn't bring with me was my paints. Uh, because I thought, I'm not gonna do art. I will be traveling. I will be like, you know, exploring, busy exploring. Uh, but this was exactly what I was missing. <laughs> so I had to buy everything from scratch. Thankfully here in Spain, in China shops, art supplies are pretty cheap. So this is this is a good investment. I will use all these paints. I will use them uh, as we go for years to come if I live that long. Anyways, uh, but yeah, uh, I had to buy everything from scratch. 
I've got few brushes with me, but I don't have like many and don't have big ones. So I got these um, builders brushes, which are just perfect size. So then I got a big board and I've got small one as well. Ah, and some other bits what I have, I got this absolutely gorgeous mirror. It's a mirror I will be using in my ASMR videos. It's gorgeous. And then I got, oh yeah, these pens as well. And then I got lace gloves to be used in some of my role plays. And I already have idea for this. Uh, and then I've got these ones. Shall we put it on? Also, guys, da -da, this t-shirt, self-made, not the t-shirt, but all the design, everything. See? Okay, I've got another one. Okay, so let's wear, wear this one today, okay? Add a little denim thing on it. Do the hair, add some accessories, and here you have it. It's always amazing feeling to undo a new canvas board. It's always so exciting. Like, I mean, I don't have idea what I want to paint on it. I just like the size of uh, this board uh, because I tried to do smaller paintings, but um, I can't do small, sorry. So it, it's got to be a large one for this artwork. I will not bother to film it and post it anywhere else than probably here on this channel because this painting will be work in process. It's not like um, I will finish it today or tomorrow or any soon in the future. I think I will just uh, paint it as I go. And what an incredible feeling that is to face yet another blank canvas. It's like facing yet another day of life. What we make of it, it's up to us. No matter the circumstances, in the end of the day, we have a choice to make it good or bad through our personal perception. Do we see our cup half empty or half full? In my case, there is no cup. There is just me in the direct contact with this magical creative energy. And I just know whatever I create will be amazing because I do it for myself and if you come along and like what I do that's just a great bonus Wow so the mission is be braver than I used to and do not overthink and do not overdo it as a mission oh my god what else we wanna do in here, baby? Best scenario ever. In my own space. With all the stuff with all the things that I need to create. It's just incredible. And a coffee, of course, very important. Mm, some people have coffee in the cup holders. I have brushes, dirty brushes. Yeah.
it is a bit windy but it is it is so nice and warm in this spot and now today it's like how many degrees saying 23 degrees but it really feels like uh, 27 in a shade whereas here is a little bit of breeze but by the beach it's uh, it's quite windy and uh, I feel even cold by the beach, by the very beach, but right here is just perfect. So we do a little bit sunbathing, baby. Where was I earlier that I didn't find the spot? And now I think I deserve a coffee. Yeah, it's a lovely day. It's it is. Yeah, yeah, it's lovely. <laughs> I don't know if you're just talking bullshit, it's yeah. going to come out on the camera. Yeah. It's on the table. <laughs> but we have tapas. Oh, we have that one. Okay. Nice. Oh, yeah. The yesterday was unbelievably... Doggy! Snoopy! <laughs> Snoopy, ciao! Hello, Charlie! Hello, my Charlie! Just check this out. Oh my god. Wow. Probably the most expensive bone I've ever bought for Snoopy. Two bones actually for that price. Yeah. Looking forward to it, Snoopy? Yeah. In Latvia we've got butcheries everywhere and you can buy cheap, cheap bones for dogs. Here is a different story in Spain. So yeah. But I love you, so here is mommy's treat to you, okay? It is good. Can you see him? Mm, yeah, I think so. Snoopy, come! Ah, he's there. I was looking at the wrong one. I think I have found the dream location and a perfect house and a bathroom is already there and look I don't have to struggle in the winter I've got asphalt road here going all the way back to the town and beach I think it's brilliant I've got some trees for privacy as well Ow. Ow. Snoopy, go there. <laughs> and wherever we go, there is always something interesting lying around. Sometimes you can find some really cool things. And then I just have to take them with me. There's just no other way. Oh my god, it's freaky. <laughs> 